Hey, what's up, everybody? Gamer Pro 8000 here, and welcome back to another reaction about SML. Where I'm going to react to their old video, and that happens to be Jeffy's Pregnancy Scare. Oh, man, Jeffy. Jeez, bro. I don't know. I should be proud of you, or I should be feeling bad for you. I mean... I don't know what it is, but I need to find out, bro. And I got to ask all you something. Do any of you ever be scared that you actually got someone else pregnant? Or that you're scared they might show up telling you that you're going to be a father? That you're going to be a mother, an uncle, or an aunt? Um, does that ever scare you? Or you should feel really proud of yourself that you actually might become just like your mom and dad. Same goes to your aunt and uncle. Does that ever scare you? Or proud of you? I mean, sometimes when they literally just show them the results and tell them that they're pregnant, they usually just run away because they're not dealing with being a father. They're not dealing with being a mother. They would just run away because they don't want to deal with a child. Or they just stay and literally just, have, I don't know, had no choice but actually just get the child support checks. Yep. And actually just get an abortion. I mean, yes, they might find a way to actually make sure they don't have to deal with any other baby. Uh-huh. Either a good parent or a terrible parent. But anyways, yeah. Me, honestly, yes. I'll be scared, but a little bit, I, I should feel proud because I might become a dad. Yep. But I already know there's so many responsibilities of you actually having your first child with someone else that you might literally just marry them. Yet, marry them, go buy a house, go buy eighty else for the baby if she actually has one. Like, you have to do all of that. Try to become a good parent. If not, then you got no chance to run right away. I mean, yeah, she might, you might find someone to raise them on your own. While you just run away, you have to deal with any of these problems. I mean, yeah, so many that can literally just give you a headache, make you feel exhausted and all that. Yep. Anyway, you guys can put in the comments all you want. I mean, yes. What's your answers? Anyways, before we get straight to this video, I just need you all to do me a huge favor. And that's the like this video. And most probably subscribe to this channel. Also, don't forget to hit the bell where you at. Thank you all so much. I appreciate that. Now let's get straight to this video and see how this goes. Alright, Crass. Today we're going to be doing another show and tell. So hopefully you brought something cool to show to Crass. What'd you bring for show and tell, Cody? I brought my violin. I learned how to play Star Wars on it. That's so cool. What'd you bring, Joseph? I brought a wash. What, Joseph? Why would you bring a wash? Why wouldn't I bring a wash, Cody? What if it stings you? It's not going to sting me. It's my pet. Duh. It's not your pet. Then why is it in this cup, huh? Well, because you trapped it in there. Guys, look what I brought for show and tell. I brought a never-before-open Hey Arnold toy. Oh, dude, that's super cool. Yeah, I guess that's kind of cool. You know how hard it is not to open up a Hey Arnold toy for years, Cody? Not, not that hard. What'd you bring, Penelope? I brought my princess piggy bank. It has $45 in it. Well, I'll give you my Hey Arnold toy for the $45. No, Junior. Oh, I'm so mad at Penelope for not giving me that money. All right, Jeffy. You come up here and show and tell first. Ooga booga booga booga! Don't be scared. It's just me. This is a lion mask that I found. Very scary, Jeffy. You can go back to your seat. All right, Penelope, it's your turn. I can't wait to show everyone my piggy bank. <laughs> Jeffy, you broke my piggy bank. You're going to have to pay for that. Well, I'm a kid dad. I don't have any money. Ha <laughs> ha, Penelope, that's what you get for not buying my Hey Arnold toy. Shut up, Junior. All right, you two, settle down. Go back to your seats. All right, Cody, you come up and present next. Hell yeah. You guys ready for your ears to explode from greatness? Okay, everybody, I'm going to be playing the intro song from Star Wars. You know, the one that goes like, da na 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 you know, you know that one? Okay, here we go. Because you didn't buy my Hey Arnold toy for $45. Oh, go cry about it, Junior. Go cry about it, bitch. Joseph. What's up, dude? I will give you my Hey Arnold toy if you put that wasp down the back of her shirt. Oh, say less. I was eyeing the Hey Arnold toy since you showed me, dude. <laughs> All 
All right, dude, I put it down a shirt. Here you go. Yes! Hey, Penelope, how you feeling? Fine. Wait, there's there's something crawling on my stomach! It's a wash! <laughs> Oh, thank you for cheering, Penelope. I'm glad you enjoyed it. Penelope, why are you creaming? Probably because she enjoys my beautiful music. Teacher, I just got stung by a wasp and I'm allergic! Now my stomach's all bloated! Well, maybe you're pregnant, Penelope. Shut up, Junior! Maybe Jeffy got you pregnant when he ran into you. <gasps> I got Penelope pregnant? Jeffy, no you didn't. Don't date that. Like, you date that little bump is actually the reason why girls get pregnant. Like, no, bro. You did not. And also, fuck you, Junior. What the fuck is wrong? You are a complete asshole. I mean, are you kidding right now? Yeah, she's right. Go cry about you, son of a bitch. And also, that Hey Arnold toy really brings back some memories. I mean, I actually enjoy that show very, very much. So did my siblings. I mean, we always enjoy that show. Rather is rather is still there or rather is on Netflix. I mean, I enjoy the show so much. But anyway, that sucks for Penelope. Yep, your dad has no choice but buy you a new piggy bank. And also playing that wash down, are you fucking kidding right now? Like wow. Like if he actually would have done that to me, then I would fucking kill him. Oh my god. Like yeah, being stunned by was like you have to deal with a lot of big bumps every time you get stunned by one. But I don't know the worst, worse than bees or something like that. But they are annoying. And I would hate to get stung by one. Hey, Danny. What's wrong, Jeffy? Did your classmates not like your lion mask? No, they did. Then why the long face? Because my mommy drank when she was pregnant with me. No, I meant why are you sad? I'm afraid to tell you. Jeffy, we're your parents. You can tell us anything. Yeah, Jeffy. You promise you won't get mad? Well, I gotta know what it is first. And you promise to take me to Disney World so I can get over it? How bad is it, Jeffy? Oh, it's really bad. Like, so bad. Like, the worst thing ever. My life is over. Did you kill someone? Well, not yet. I mean, she gets to make that decision later on down the line. You know, her body, her choice. What are you talking about, Jeffy? I got a girl pregnant. What? You got a girl pregnant, Jeffy? Why would you do that? Well, hey, it's not my fault. Oh, it is your fault, Jeffy. You're the one who did it. Well, I ran into her and I busted her pink piggy open and then she asked me to pay for it. She asked you to pay for it? Yeah. Oh, my God, baby Jeffy. I caught up in some weird money situation. Oh, baby Jeffy, are you sure she's pregnant? Yeah, her belly's already big. Well, Jeffy, why didn't you tell us sooner? Well, I just found out today. Oh, my God. Are you sure it's yours? Yeah, I mean, I did bust that pink piggy wide open, Daddy. I get made a mess. It was all over the carpet. Ew, Jeffy! Well, where'd you even do this at, Jeffy? In the classroom. Oh, Jeffy, you're sick. You are sick, Jeffy. Why would you do that? Well, it was an accident. I hope it was an accident. I hope you didn't plan on doing this, Jeffy. Well, yeah, it was the first time I ran into her. Oh, my God, Jeffy, you're supposed to get the nose on before you do that. Oh, my God, baby, what do we do? We need to call a doctor. Well, there's always plan B. Jeffy, it's too late for that. Her belly's already big. Well, plan B as in push her down the stairs. That's not a bad idea. Marvin! No, baby, it looks like Jeffy's too young to have a kid. He can't raise a kid. Marvin! Okay, fine. We'll call a doctor and ask him what stairs he recommends pushing her down. Hey there, somebody call a doctor? Yeah, doctor, we're not doing so good. Yeah, me neither, man. This economy, am I right? Ugh, I am barely scraping by. I don't even know if I can afford to keep the lights on next month. My panic attacks keep me up at night. No, I'm talking about Jeffy got someone pregnant. Oh, congratulations. Is it a boy or a girl? I got a girl pregnant. But no, I mean, is the baby a boy or a girl? We don't know yet. We'll let it decide when it gets older. But hopefully it identifies as dead soon. But, okay, so what do you need me for? Listen, doctor, he got a girl pregnant and he hasn't told us who she is yet, but we're just scared. What do we do? Well, Sasquatch probably went back into the woods. What? Well, I mean, no offense to Jeffy, but she had to be pretty hideous if she was willing to bang him. I mean, my daughter would never. She's a straight-A student, and she has respect for herself. What would you do if your daughter got pregnant? I'd probably kill her. Strangle her, actually. Yeah, you know, hold her underwater in the bathtub for about three minutes? That ought to do it. Yeah. But I don't have to worry about that, because she is perfect. Actually, I don't even think she likes boys. Between me and you, I think she prefers Runch and Mug, if you know what I mean. Well, listen, we just don't know what to do. We've never dealt with a situation like this before. Well, I would suggest calling her over here and having her take a pregnancy test to see if she's even pregnant. I don't want to ask a girl to take a pregnancy test. That's weird. Yeah, we wouldn't want that. How about this? How about I hide behind the couch and you call her over, and then when she gets here, I jump out and scare her so she pees a little bit, because I'm pretty scary, and then I'll catch some of that pee with a pregnancy test, and then we'll know if she's pregnant or not. You're not scary. Yeah, I guess you're right. I'm not really the... Ah! Ha! See? I'm scary. You jumped. 
Yeah, you are pretty scary. I like your plan more than just asking her to take a pregnancy test. Yeah. Well, we already know she's pregnant because her belly is big. Listen, I'm sure she's f***ing huge. That doesn't mean she's pregnant. You know, Olga's can get pretty big. I mean, I bet she looks like Fiona from Shrek, you know, after sundown. But you should call her over here because I don't want to have to go to a swamp. Okay, yeah, Jeffy, you go get the girl. You hide behind the couch. Okay, I'll do that. And he's going to find out that his daughter was the one that Jeffy got her pregnant. Which is not even true. He just thought of that. But anyways, <laughs> he said it was all the carpet. <laughs> he said he did it in the classroom. <laughs> oh my god, that is fucking sick. Oh man, I really thought he was going to tell him next about, yes, the whole class was watching us doing it. <laughs> Oh man, imagine he telling him that. <laughs> oh man, and also, yeah, I think we best you push her down the stairs. <laughs> just kidding, just kidding. Yeah, why can't you just do that to Rose? If she was pregnant, push her down the stairs. I mean, I would do it too. And also, I don't even know what's the point of scaring her. I mean, what are you going to do? Scare the hell out of her until a baby comes out of her? I mean, if that even works in real life, then that would be fucking crazy. But anyway, this should shock everybody else when Penelope gets there. Alright now she's right there! So you're the girl who's causing all these problems. Look, I just want my money. <gasps> Have some dignity, young lady. I want my $45! $45? That's all she charged you? Hey, I worked hard for that. Yeah, I'm sure you did work hard with all that nasty stuff you did to Jeffy. How often do you do stuff like this? Do what? You know, bust your piggy open. That was my first time, and it was really embarrassing. I couldn't even show off my piggy for show and tell. You were gonna show off your Piggy for show and tell? Your father must be ashamed. I'm so glad we're trying to get rid of it. Get rid of what? You know, will, will you get rid of it? Get rid of what? I just want my money. If we give you the $45, will you do what we want? Um, yeah, sure. Okay, I'll give her the $45. I got 50 I got 100 in my wallet. Okay, yeah, deal. All right, broken guy, you can come on out. She just wants money. <laughs> wow, Marvin. I heard the whole thing. She sounds like a real gold digger. Oh, hey, Penelope, what are you doing here? Wait, Marvin, where'd the girl go? I want to show my daughter what a real slut looks like. Uh, she is the girl. Penelope, you hussy! What? You're the girl who busted a piggy open? Yeah, I accidentally ran into Jeffy and he busted it open. Oh, this is a parent's worst nightmare. I thought I raised you better than that. And why are you charging money for it? Because he busted my piggy open! Oh, sweet Jesus. I shattered her piggy. You mother or I'll kill you! Hey, 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 stop fighting, stop fighting. We can't change what happened. It already happened. Yeah, I guess you're right. It was an accident, right, Jeffy? Yeah. yeah. And I've had plenty of accidents, too. I mean, that's how Penelope was born. What? Listen, she said she'll get rid of it for $45. Get rid of what? Oh, you're getting rid of it, young lady. There's no way you're ready for that. What are you talking about? Oh, don't even try to hide it. Your stomach is huge. Oh, that? Yeah, I want to get rid of that. Oh, thank God. I was going to come to you for help as a doctor. Oh, good, because there's like there's some stairs over there, so I could just give you a knuckle sandwich right in the stomach. Um, isn't that gonna make it worse? I mean, yeah, it's gonna hurt, and it's not gonna be fun, but then again, you already had your fun, didn't you? I didn't have fun with this. It was a really mean prank all the boys at school played on me. Everyone was in on it, and it hurt and stung. Oh, bee needle dick. I'll kill you. Oh, okay, God, that is, that is, that is no fighting. Listen, she said she's willing to do a solution, so you just gotta find out which one she wants to do. Okay, yeah. Penelope, how do you want to get rid of it? I don't know. Like, a shot? Ooh, a shot, a shot. Yeah, that's that's the best way of doing it. Um, I keep my shots over here, by the stairs. Okay. All right, Dad, where's the shot? Here's a shot. Right in the gut. Dad, what the hell was that for? Okay, I think that might have done it. How's your stomach feel? It hurts, but it hurt before, too. Hmm, I think we need to go to the top of the stairs and do it a few more times. How is that going to help my wasp sting? I'm sorry, you what? I got stung by a wasp on the stomach. Wait, 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 wait. So you're telling me you didn't get pregnant? What? Ew, no, Dad. But, but what about your piggy getting busted open? I brought my piggy bank for show and tell, and Jeffy knocked into me, and it shattered on the floor. Oh, oh, thank God. Oh, I am so happy. What the hell did you think happened? Uh, nothing, nothing. Just keep your pure, innocent mind pure and innocent. Look, look, you just go home, and I will go upstairs and explain to those nice people what happened. Okay. Whew. Yeah, what a relief. I don't have to raise another kid anymore. I don't have to pay another child support anymore. And I'm really glad my daughter is not a slut. And also, I can't believe he literally just pushed his own daughter down the stairs. Bro, you about to kill her. <laughs> and also, Jeffy's saying, 
I shatter her piggy bank. <laughs> oh, man. And also, next time, she better be more specific, dumbass. Yeah, seriously. Be more specific. Seriously. <laughs> and also, she charge you for money. <laughs> Oh man, they think she's on the street. Oh my god. <laughs> it's freaking hilarious. <laughs> oh man. I ain't gonna lie, this is freaking hilarious as hell. I would imagine she was actually doing it. She would become a complete hoe in the future. Good news, everyone. Is it good? Well, technically, shibby. Well, not even shibby, because it turns out she wasn't pregnant to begin with. Oh, thank God. Woohoo! Pull out Game Strong is fun. Well, no, not even that, because it turns out she and Jeffy didn't even do anything. But what about all the busting the piggy stuff? Oh, well, she brought her piggy bank to school for show and tell, and Jeffy just accidentally broke it. Then why was her stomach so big? Oh, uh, she gets stung on the stomach by a wasp, and she's really allergic to wasps. That's why it swelled up so much. Well, Jeffy, why did you think you got her pregnant? Because I ran into her, and then everyone said she was pregnant. But that's not where babies come from. Yeah, this whole thing, let's just be happy that it was a big misunderstanding. Yep. Mm hmm Yep. yep. It's a big misunderstanding. Big misunderstanding. Yep. Big misunderstanding. Yep. Big misunderstanding. Yep. That's a big yep. misunderstanding. Good yep. happy ending. Yes, a big misunderstanding. Good time. Okay, I'm going to go. Can we go to Disney World? Yay! You're going to take me to Disney World! I don't know where is he going or why is he flying up. I hope he comes down. Like, come on, Marvin. Are you part of Bird or something? Like, that doesn't make any sense. <laughs> and also, yeah, it was a big misunderstanding. Yeah, it was very really funny that they're literally just shaking their head up and down, up and down. Like, it was to rock and roll or something. Like, come on. <laughs> oh, man. But, yeah, it's true. It was a misunderstanding. Like, she, yeah. They really thought Jeffy literally got Penelope pregnant, like, <laughs> oh man, and did it in front of the class, like, imagine we hear about this, we will literally see it on social media, imagine that, I mean, that would be fucking crazy, that will literally be all over the world, oh man, <laughs> yeah, that would be crazy, anyways, what video this was, so, I don't know where to start. I mean, Jeffy really thought he got Penelope pregnant because you bump into her, not nail her or anything like that. Like, come on, bro. You need to understand my pregnancy. I mean, you're 18 years old. You need to understand my pregnancy. Oh, man. <laughs> oh, man. And now with that, also, he, he broke her piggy banks. <laughs> oh, man. That reaction to broken guy's face. Oh, man. <laughs> when he realized that Jeffy was the girl that he thought that he got her pregnant with. I mean, <laughs> oh, man. That, that was the funniest part of this video. I like it. <laughs> and now with that, but it's also crazy that he pushed his own daughter down the stairs. I mean, like. Come on, bro. That was your old daughter. You could have killed her. Oh, jeez. Like, is this the only solution for them to actually solve to get rid of a baby? Then that's just cruel. That is just completely cruel. Like, come on. I would not do something like this. That's really stupid. Anyways, I'm just going to sign right here. So, I'll be CLA in the next video by SML. But till then, y'all have a nice day out there. And I'll be CLA later, alright? So, peace out, stay pro, let everyone.